In a groundbreaking shift for U.S. military technology, the U.S. Army has officially approved the Abrams M1E3 as the next step in its main battle tank, MBT, modernization strategy, effectively ending the previously planned Abrams SEPV-4 program. This decision, made by Army senior leaders in May 2023, marks a significant evolution in the Army's approach to armored vehicle capabilities, focusing on advanced technology, enhanced mobility, and greater survivability on the modern battlefield. The M1A2 Abrams tank, first introduced in 1980, has long been a pillar of U.S. military strength. Over the decades, the Army has consistently upgraded the Abrams to meet evolving threats and technological advances. The SEPV-3 program, which brought upgrades like improved armor, better fire control, and the addition of a commander's remote-operated weapon station, kept the Abrams competitive. However, with the changing nature of modern warfare, the Army recognized the need for a new direction. Enter the Abrams M1E3. While the SEPV-4 program was initially designed to enhance the Abrams ballistic protection, thermal sights, and integrate a higher-performance active protection system, APS, the Army has decided to incorporate many of these planned upgrades into the M1E3. The result is a tank that is not only more agile and mobile but also maintains the Abrams reputation for lethality and survivability in combat. The M1E3 will be lighter and more tactically flexible, making it capable of maneuvering across diverse terrains and adapting to modern battlefield scenarios. However, this mobility doesn't come at the cost of protection. With upgraded armor and an advanced APS, the M1E3 will remain well-equipped to handle the latest anti-tank threats, including missiles and other high-powered projectiles. But the M1E3 isn't just about mobility and protection. It will also integrate the latest electronics, powertrain systems, and advanced sensors, such as laser warning receivers and improved thermal management systems. These technologies will enable the tank to maintain battlefield dominance, improving its ability to detect, track, and engage targets with deadly precision. The Army's decision to forego the SEPV-4 in favor of the M1E3 reflects a broader shift in military strategy. By folding many of the SEPV-4's planned upgrades into the M1E3, the Army can streamline its modernization efforts while ensuring that the Abrams tank remains at the cutting edge of technology. The M1E3 is designed to meet the challenges of future warfare, blending advanced technology with the proven survivability and firepower that the Abrams is known for. In the meantime, the Army will continue upgrading its existing M1A2 Abrams tanks under the SEPV-3 program, ensuring that the fleet remains capable as the M1E3 is developed. The SEPV-3 upgrades include enhanced armor, fire control, and powertrain systems, keeping the M1A2 relevant on the battlefield. As the M1E3 progresses through development, it will represent a new era in tank warfare. Combining mobility, firepower, and survivability, the Abrams M1E3 will ensure that the U.S. Army stays ahead of its adversaries in an ever-evolving strategic landscape. The decision to move forward with the M1E3 is a bold step towards creating a more advanced, agile, and deadly tank that will shape the future of armored warfare for decades to come.